Hi children in this module we shall listen to the story of Peter and see how Peter saves Wendy from Captain Hook and his gang of pirates Wendy was out in the forest when Captain Hook and his gang of pirates captured her and the children The pirates tied the hands and feet of Wendy and the other children with rope and took them to the ship I want their captain Peter Pan Hook Thunder it was he who fed my arm to that crocodile whispered Hook Captain Hook was scared of that one crocodile it liked his arm so much that it followed him to eat the rest of him The crocodile had swallowed a clock and whenever it is close by one could hear the tick tock inside it. So before the crocodile could reach Captain Hook he heard the tick and ran. After a while Hook found Peter sleeping. He noticed some bottles of medicine lying on a chair nearby. Quietly he poisoned the medicine and tiptoed away. Watching all this was Tinkerbell a fairy. She flew to Peter, woke him up and said that Wendy was in trouble. Before rushing out to save Wendy, when Peter decided to take his medicine, Tinkerbell stopped him and said that it has been poisoned by Captain Hook. Thus Peter was saved and he rushed out to save Wendy. Peter walked through the forest looking for the pirate ship. He found Hook walking up and down the deck deep in thought. The children all chained up in front of him were shivering with fear. Suddenly they heard the terrible tick-tock of the crocodile. They turned in the direction from which the sound was coming. Hook's face turned pale with fright. He asked his gang of pirates to hide him and they took him away to a safe hiding place. When Hook was gone, some of the children rushed to the ship's side to see the crocodile climbing it. To their sweetest surprise, there was no crocodile climbing up. It was Peter who was making the ticking sound. Thus, Peter Pan saved Wendy. and the other children from the cruel captain hook and his gang of pirates so children i hope you enjoyed the story of peter pan and wendy see you in the next class